Fresh artichokes, a thing of beauty, but they can be a little prickly in the kitchen. I have a whole arsenal of tools here, but I'm gonna show you how to use them so you can turn your artichoke into a wonderful meal. We're gonna start with the serrated knife. First, I'm gonna trim off about the top third of the artichoke leaves off the top. Sawing back and forth and turning the artichoke occasionally if needed to get a nice clean cut across the top. How beautiful. Then, I'm gonna trim away the extra tough layers of leaves, just using our fingers. Now this is starting to look a little bit more manageable. Next, I'm gonna take my kitchen shears, one of my favorite kitchen tools, and trim away any remaining prickly tops of the artichoke leaves. This makes all the leaves easy to grab when you're getting ready to eat them. Next, we wanna trim the root end. Sometimes when you get the root, it will be browned along the bottom. We're gonna trim it down with your paring knife, and be sure to keep a cut lemon nearby. Rub all of your cut ends with the lemon juice to keep it from browning. Next, we'll need our chef's knife. Place the cut end flat on the cutting board and slice directly through the middle. Revealing the beautiful inside. You can use a spoon or a melon baller, which is sometimes sharper, to remove the choke. Lay your artichoke flat on your board and use a spoon to pull away all of the hairy and prickly insides. It may take a little time, but trust me, what is left is worth it. Then pull out the purple choke with your fingers. Once you've peeled away all the purple insides, rub the cut side with the lemon, and then if you're not ready to cook them right away, put them in a bowl of water with lemon juice. And make sure that they're fully submerged. Fresh artichokes, a work of art worth mastering.